So I tried recording every day. That didn't work. Yeah, that immediately flopped. Also, I just, I can't keep up with every day. hands. Alright, there's the oven. So I went to the doctor today, got shit figured out. Um... I am going to try to go to the gym tomorrow, but I haven't had the energy because the weather's been crap. It's been nice for the last few days, you know? Just not recently. It's basically smells like the same freaking shit. But I've been doing okay. I'm just tired. I can't keep up with shit lately. I know it's not my own fault, but it's just been too much. Ugh. Probably should wash my hands. It's just been difficult getting out and getting moving again. You know how that is. It's just something that you gotta conquer daily. Hopefully, I can get my meds um, checked and picked up today. Because I need it. Because I'm fat. Yay, hormone imbalances. Which are so common and so great to deal with. Being sarcastic here. Anyways, I'm just... I don't know. Like, lately, I've been sort of just taking it day by day. I am tired. I am exhausted. I didn't need a few days rest from working out, but I need to go on a more consistent basis. Other than two or three of the fuck it, for two or three frickin' hours. Like, seriously need to come up with, start coming up with a routine to make me lose more weight because I'm starting to skyrocket. And that's not good for me because that'll make me diabetic. Hold on while I do this meat. But I'm going to try. I'm just having a really bad sugar craving lately. At least I don't have anything to go to this week. 
Due the end of this month. Got therapy again for right now. This is just going to be kind of a rant thing. Just kind of letting my feelings out. I do feel like I've been doing good. I do feel better than I have been in a really long time. I know I should probably start doing these vlogs more often so I can start having better conversations with people. But sometimes it's just really difficult to get out there and do things with others. I don't know if it's because of my autism or it's just because it's pure social anxiety. But it's just easier for me to talk to... Basically, I feel like I'm talking to myself. Because I see myself in the camera. I see... Probably, maybe, a potential of three people watching this. But that's probably because... I tell them about my channel. I don't really... I know I should probably upload it a little more actively because I've got the time now. But... Does it really matter if I upload once a month or never at all? Well, once a month is better than nothing. That's what I've been learning, so... Excuse me while I drink this. <sighs> but I haven't been eating a whole lot of sugar, I haven't been eating a whole lot of bread. My weight still is going up because I'm not on a certain medication I need. Which sucks because I'm trying so hard to get in shape. I don't want to gain weight, I want to lose the weight. And it sucks because I'm sitting here with all this fucking effort. I'm seeing nothing for results. That is not very good. Like, I'm putting in all this effort. I know I should probably be doing more effort. But I'm doing my best. And I'm trying to work out and trying to lose a little weight. I want my pants to fit again. I don't have to wear, like, size triple X. Because 209 pounds... And I look like a fucking elephant. It's bad. It's just I'm tired of looking fat. I'm tired of having this. And having to squish it in, push it in, and hold it up. So I can just do basic things and it's so fucking frustrating. I hate being fat. But I have fucking, I can't do, be fat and still have chronic pain. If I lose the weight, maybe my chronic pain will go away, finally. I know food's always been my biggest issue. Food's always been, oh, engorge yourself. Trying not to. Trying to substitute juice in the mornings for myself. Which isn't the best option, but it's the only option I got. <sighs> yeah. I keep forgetting I'm wearing this shirt. But I don't have a lot of options. I don't have space to go do things that I really want to go do. But I can't, I can't do them unless I lose this weight. I want to wear a bikini again, but I look like I'm fucking pregnant all the time because my stomach is so big. I mean, like, if I push it out just a little bit, I look fucking pregnant. And it's disgusting. It's just, it's not who I want to be. 
and I finally have the drive to do it and my body's suddenly like, no, you're not, you're not doing it. Because I don't know exactly what I'm doing, but I'm going to keep trying anyways because that's how you do it. You keep experimenting and you keep going. I know it sounds like total dog shit coming from a fat person, but I'm trying to better my life. I don't want to weigh up, suddenly skyrocket to 400 pounds and then realize my life has gone nowhere. My life is going nowhere right now. I don't need the extra fatness to just make me want to die a little faster. Cause you know, it's just not, it's not me. I don't want to be this way. I don't want to do this by myself anymore. It's not a thing I want to be. It's not where I want to be with my, my life right now. Yes, I'm making myself a fucking smoothie so I can cut down on dinner. I also need one of these because my muscles are cramping. And I think throwing in an extra banana would do me good right now. I don't want to be where I am now. I don't want to be that girl that's always been the fat girl. And it's just so depressing. I remember being so active and super happy, but I didn't have time to be depressed because I couldn't be depressed or my freaking abusive ass father would pick on it and make it worse. Especially if I let him know about it. So I didn't have time to do depression. I had time to be sad. I didn't have time to full on go depressed. And antisocialness. Because I lived in a very tiny town. And I hated it. I hated every second of it. So yeah. I'm going to try to be a better person. I'm going to try to get better. I think it just... Make my life over. Basically what I'm going to try to do.